It's snowing! It's snowing in the Smokies, y'all! <laughs> and it's like these little, little bouncing little balls of snow. Yeah. I don't know what type this is. Yeah, it's like little, it looks like little popcorn. Yeah, you can see it like... I mean, um, pretzel salt. Pretzel salt, exactly what it looks like. Yeah, it's like little tiny balls. Yeah. So cool. Look at the mountain, it looks It ominous. was supposed to snow yeah. all night long. It did We not. woke up, there was not a lick of snow. No frost? No frost. Nothing. Literally no nothing. I'm like, what the heck? It's in the afternoon now. Almost 12 o'clock. It finally started. It's so it's so bright. Look at Cody. Look, oh, like look at Cody. <laughs> Cody, you have some dandruff. <laughs> <laughs> it's completely different than the snow, you know, that we the previous snow that we got. Yeah. So look at this. I don't know if it's gonna stick or not, but yeah, I don't know. We're happy to see it falling. Yeah. Oh look, yeah, you can see the, the mountain. You can definitely tell there's some ice or snow up there now. Uh huh. When I woke up this morning, the mountain just looked normal. We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. RV TV, K and E R V TV, sing it with us. Mac, is there snowing on you? <laughs> is there snowing on you? <laughs> you described it perfect because it literally. Looks like snow. Right? It bounces like it. It's like bouncing. <laughs> it like, so we can always hear the rain on top of our roof in yeah. the RV, but the snow, it sounds like, different. I don't know, yeah, it, it sounds different. It's funny because it rained a little bit this morning, and <laughs> we're sitting here, and we just actually took the dogs for a walk out the Ongo. And then we're sitting inside, I'm like, is that snow? Is it snowing? And I opened the door, and, and it was snowing! Because like, <laughs> <laughs> we've been getting a teaser saying since like last week that we're going to get snow this Monday. And then we, we were checking the weather all last night. Uh -huh. It said it was going to snow all night. It was like 80%, yeah. 60%, and 40%, and then we literally got nothing. Right. Till now. Well, it's, it's a little late. Yeah, I don't think it's that type of sticking snow, I guess. It's kind of so fluffy. Uh -huh. Maybe kind of more like... It's still a little warm out. Pale? I don't know. But we're not snow professionals, so do you know what kind of snow it is? It's only 35 degrees. Yeah, the snow. yeah so maybe if it was colder, it would be... More heavy and sticky. <laughs> Don't mind Aaron's gray hairs. <laughs> uh, this is fun. It is. I love it. <laughs> Aaron's about to get this now. I can see it in your eyelashes. It tickles. <laughs> this is fun. It's so weird though because it's not like staying, but it's like pretty. Are you enjoying this? Are you having so much fun? Yeah. He's like, I just want to go bye bye in the car. Because yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, any reason to be outside, I'm in. This one over here, he's like, can we go back inside now? <laughs> it looks like slushy ice. Yeah, like snow cone, slushy ice. Yeah. Can we make snow cones? <laughs> <laughs> we need enough snow to bring Ricky back to life. I know, we need a snowman. Come on, snow stick. Oh, here. Snow stick. Snow is stick. It even, is it even snow? Like, huh? I don't even know. Is it considered snow? I mean, like the little white ones. Then, like, I don't know. We don't know anything. He just wants to hit me with snowballs, so I don't know that much. And I want to go sledding. Yeah. Down that hill. Ooh, it's coming down. It like starts coming down, and then it stops, and then it starts, and it stops. Now it's started again. <laughs> Sorry, people. Winter Wonderland. I know you people from up north are like, keep the snow. We don't care. A slot of girls. This, <laughs> this is exciting for us. It's still exciting. <gasps> it's coming down. <laughs> we love it. Like on black, you can see it so yeah. well. I feel like we're probably, you think we're nerds, but. Now that it's cleared up, the mountaintop looks so <laughs> beautiful with that little bit of snow up there and the light hitting just the top. With the blue sky. Oh, it's, wow. I'm gonna try to zoom in, but. Can we go up there? Oh, it's so pretty. Can we get all the way up there? Beautiful. But it snowed for a little bit here, but nothing lasted. Yeah, nothing, nothing stuck, but it was still really pretty and cold. <laughs> but luckily there wasn't too much wind or anything going on, so. It's just cold yeah. now. Yeah. It's just cold, but Aaron's gonna cook us some dinner in the crock pot. Yeah, baby, perfect night for it. Mm-hmm, I'm excited. It's so pretty behind you, wow. Gorgeous. Cool the sunsets over here. All right, so we're gonna get some dinner started, and tonight we're gonna have some country 
boneless pork ribs in the crock pot. Ooh. We have made this before on the channel. It's super, super easy. You can basically use a lot of ingredients that you already have at home. And last time we made these, I did with barbecue sauce. So this time, I have some of my sweet Baby Ray's garlic parmesan sauce, which I love for chicken. And I'm gonna try this instead because we don't have any barbecue sauce. And I wanna use some things we have on hand. And I also have this Flavor God lemon garlic seasoning. So we're gonna use that as our dry rub. And then the Parmesan garlic Baby Ray's sauce as our, our wet for our ribs in the crock pot. And I'm just gonna do a little salt and pepper. First, we're gonna do a little black pepper. So this is like a pound and a half? Yeah, about a pound and a half of the country style boneless pork ribs. And we're gonna do a little pink Himalayan salt. Then we're gonna take our Flavor God lemon garlic and a good amount of this. This um, seasoning doesn't have any added salt or anything. Good amount, and then I'm gonna go ahead and massage this on there just to kind of get all of the ribs coated really well before I drop them in the pot. Mm. Give it a nice massage, yeah, man. I'm just gonna get in here and kind of give them a good massage, like Kim said. <laughs> when do I get a massage? <laughs> I think I'm gonna actually add a little more. More seasoning? Yeah. Okay. So my a lovely assistant added some more seasoning since my gloves are all, whoop, whoop. all I needy. did some work, y'all. <laughs> She's the best sous chef ever. Yes. So I think they're pretty, pretty well coated. Yeah, so I'm just gonna dice up a little onion and throw that in the bottom of the pot. So I went ahead and like kind of minced up or finely chopped a small sweet onion. And we're gonna put that right in the bottom of the crock pot. Crock pot with the liner. Yes, liners are so amazing. They make this so, so easy. Easy cleanup, which I love. And we're actually gonna head out to um, do a little work tonight. So we're gonna leave the crock pot going, come back and have dinner ready. Hopefully the RV doesn't burn down. That's crock pot. Woo! So I dropped the chopped onions down in the bottom of the crock pot and I'm just gonna drizzle a little of the garlic sauce on top of those. Just kind of give them a little stir so they get a little coated with some flavor as well. That was a fun shot. I like yeah. flavor. We want flavor on everything. You know what I'm saying? Yes, ma'am. Flavor on everything. And I'm just going to drop the um, ribs right on top of my little chopped onion parmesan garlic layer. So I tried to make, you know, as even of a layer with the ribs as I could. They're all kind of different sizes. So you know, I just, I did the best that I can. It's no big deal. It's going to cook low and slow anyway. And now I'm going to top this with some more of our garlic parmesan baby rays. Woo! I can't wait to eat this. I hope it's going to be good. I mean, I really love this sauce. Everything that I have put it on has been delicious. So mm -hmm. I'm, I'm not upset about it. I think I will just do another little sprinkle of the flavor guy just on top. Just to guarantee all the, f that we're going to get a good because I love um, the taste of lemon and garlic and Parmesan kind of together. Mm -hmm. So that's what I was going for. So we'll see how it turns out. We're just going to pop the top on it. And we're going to do low for three to four hours. Alrighty. So our pork ribs have been in the slow cooker on low for a little over three hours. And I'm going to make some um, Nor pasta side. It's just Parmesan pasta in the microwave. And I have some frozen broccoli that I'm just going to cook in the air fryer. I just sprayed it with a little bit of cooking spray. And then I also added the lemon garlic seasoning to that. And that's going to go in the air fryer. But you want to, I wish smell vision was real because <laughs> this, these ribs smell incredible. Garlic Parmesan. Oh, it smells so good. I can't wait to try this. Yeah, I really hope they're good. If they're not, hey, you know, we, we tried. It was like, honest, they were like six bucks at yeah, Aldi. We got them very cheap at Aldi, so we figured, you know, we can experiment a little bit. And I don't think they'll be unedible, if anything, uh -uh. but it smells incredible. Oh, no, no. <laughs> it's giving my noodles a little stir. <laughs> my glasses are fun. <laughs> <laughs> they go, um, the back right direction is you add a cup and a half of water, a half cup of milk, a tablespoon of butter and then cook in the microwave for four minutes. Take it out and stir. And then we're gonna do another 
for me. Super easy. And I Super love this easy. in the old school Tupperware. Uh -huh. This was like Kim's parents back yeah. in the day. day, day. <laughs> I have used this thing so much every single place we have lived. Tupperware where it's and, at. Ah, and this is back when things were made with quality. Nothing has to be 30 years old. Uh -huh. like, at least. So I wish yeah, it's pretty made, old. Yeah, I wish things were made like that still. Steaming. It's, it's so hot, but it smells so, <laughs> so good. Let's look at our food. I don't know. I guess I have to eat it with a fork. So these are boneless pork ribs, oh, wow. no bones whatsoever. Just fall apart like it that really in the is. crock pot. Yeah. Wow. And uh, the broccoli roasted in the air fryer. It was so good. Really, really good. How long did you cook it in there for? In our pasta. Mm. It's delicious. Sorry, I'm going to rib already. You like the you like it? Mm-hmm. It was good. How long did we cook it for in the crock pot? Probably like three and a half hours. Three and a half. It could have probably been good at three. We just weren't home yet. Uh-huh. Sorry, I got choked up on my piece of rib, <laughs> but it's so so good. Super but I tender. think three hours would have been like perfect. So they're definitely tender, but I think it could have been a little less. Mm -hmm. And our little noodles are great. Broccoli's really good. And I just basically seasoned the chicken. And the broccoli, I mean the chicken, <laughs> the pork and the broccoli, pretty similar. It goes goes well together. I love this garlic parmesan sauce. Yeah, it's so good. Like, I think you could put it on anything and it would be Dip it in delicious. there. Delicious. Oh so easy. So easy. Quick, easy meal. <laughs> we love those. <laughs> well, that was disgusting. <laughs> the ribs came out really good. Mm -hmm. I love meat cooked in a crock pot. Yeah, and that sauce just like it just works grow really really well. Mm -hmm. Everything was delicious, delicious. We're watching Crazy Rich Asians. Yeah, it's, it's such a good movie. movie. It's really really funny. It's a really good movie. Yeah, we're just gonna digest our food a little bit. It's freezing outside. Everything's already frosted. Over. Yes, I wish it was snowing. Mm -hmm. I know. I'm just, I'm happy that we got a little bit this morning. Right, Code. Uh, we got our space heater over here. Yeah, we got a little Zachary, space heater. Zachary lays right in front of it. He does. He's a space. He's a heat heat hog. Heat hog. <laughs> heat heater hog. hog. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for dinner. Yeah, I'm so glad it came out good, and it was so easy. Everybody, you saw what I did. It was super super easy. Yay! It's the next day. We got into a coma after we ate dinner last night and the we're like was so good. Kim fell asleep in her chair <laughs> most nights. Do any of you have that superpower? <laughs> that you can just just knock out sitting straight up in your chair because <gasps> I don't I have I have a problem just going to sleep in my bed. But anyway, yeah. So good morning. I don't have that frosty. problem. I don't have that problem. <laughs> it's a frosty morning. It's here. a very Smoky. frosty morning. The snow that happened yesterday did not stick or anything, at least not here. But we're out walking the dogs this morning. It's like 27 degrees. It's yep. chilly. But it says it's going to get into the 50s. Today. Everything is frozen. Oh, Cody. Cody. Cody, what's that? Frozen puddles. Is that your frozen puddle you like? He's licking it, good. He made this cool design. Oh, he's licking it. <laughs> he loves, he loves he puddles. He loves licking ice and puddles. Go on it, Cody. What's that, Cody? Stop eating the dirt. <laughs> Don't eat the dirt. Go in your puddle. Come on. Go. <laughs> go, Cody. Don't drink that nasty water. <laughs> I got the ice. We're gonna chunk it. This is some really thick ice yeah, too. I'm impressed. It's really th <laughs> thick. Normally it's just like a thin layer on there. Yeah. Ready? I love the sound that it makes. Ice, ice. Ready? <laughs> it sounds like glass. It looks like a <sighs> Happy New Year! <laughs> so. The last couple days it had been raining, so we had these big puddles out here in the field, and now they're frozen they're puddles. Frozen. Aaron's like stepping on them, the dogs are stepping on them, Cody's licking them, hoping we don't fall and bust our butts. But it looks like they're like regular puddles. Oh you breaking the ice? Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. It's really cool. Looks like it little, little <laughs> see through, and it's like. Yeah, oh, there's a bug in there. Don't get your foot wet. Stop it, Cody. I'm gonna get a me book. Look at this one. Frozen wow. puddles. <laughs> Don't hurt yourself, ma'am. Wow. Do it. It's thick. It's like it's at like least thick. half an inch. Yeah. Man. She thick. She's thick. Down in the creek. Ooh, that was fun. <gasps> that sounded so cool. Do that again. <gasps> That's fun. 
Look you could like ice skate. I know it, it looks so cool. <laughs> you tell we're from Florida. <laughs> Can you ice skate on here? <laughs> that sounds so That's cool. So wow. Just the sound is amazing. But it's just so cool. You can like see the grass underneath the ice. Sorry y'all. We're from Florida. <laughs> I know. <laughs> can you please not slip? Please Cody, not like really Cody. <laughs> they, they don't know what's happening. He's just he's just happy no matter what. <laughs> How's the creek doing? It's nice having this. Right behind our park. Oh, you want to drop a tube in here and float around? Right. We, haven't done it yet. we got some good current here. Here's a piece of firewood. Piece of firewood. Oh, there. I'm always on the hunt for firewood, y'all. It's just so pretty, so calm, relaxing, chill. That's why we love. We love living here. It's a major difference from living in South Florida, Florida in general. Aaron's being a child. I want to throw a rock. She wants puddle. to throw a rock into the ice puddle. Okay, ready? It looks like. Set, go. Oh, we're like stuck in the middle of it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. That's cool. That's crazy. Careful. Careful, everyone. Do it again. Oh, that one's bigger over here. What about this puddle? Cody's stepping in the puddle. He just wants the water. <laughs> he just wants the water. He's so crazy. He will not drink his water in the house. Race neck? Go. That's <laughs> so cool. That means it's not safe to walk on. Ready? Look at this big old piece. <laughs> We're like children. Oh, you having fun? Yes. Your babies? You having fun? Ready to go home? Like my toes are you, you got cold feet? I got cold feet. All right, let's go home. So we found a frozen part of the creek over here. I guess because it's like in the shade. In the shade over here. So I'm gonna throw a rock. <laughs> throw a rock in it. Ready? Yes. Oh, wow, that was a big splash. Yeah. It's only like a little frozen layer on top. Uh -huh. Wow. It's an old ice cream. <laughs> Okay, babies, let's go home and cool the pizza off. Let me warm them up. Warm them up. <laughs> That's what I meant. Thanks for hanging out with us, y'all. Hope y'all had a great day. Hopefully you guys got some snow, too. Yeah. Who knows? We definitely enjoyed our snow in the beginning of the video and our frost at the end Frost. Of the <laughs> frost yourself. <laughs> what movie is that from? Right. Leave a comment. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you so much if you enjoyed this video please hit your like button if you have not subscribed please subscribe and we will see you in the next episode bye y'all